Hello everyone, Liliana from Vanilla and Canela here. Welcome back to my channel and to another video. Now I know some of you were probably not expecting to see me until next year, but I had to go to Aldi because we ran out of nappies and I thought, let me share it with you, why not? And if you want to see it at the end, I'll be sharing a little bit of our Christmas, just little snippets that I filmed during the holiday season, which we're still in. But anyway, let me show you what I got in Aldi. Frozen stuff, I have two bags of calamari. One is the battered rings, um, delicious squid rings. And then I have soy and chili calamari. They both looked really delicious. They were £2.50 each. I thought that was really good. Some prawns. And then they had these chocolate eclairs. They're frozen, like I said. But they reduced them to like 50 odd P, 49p, that was it. Some more of these little ice creams. And then I've never tried these buttermilk fish burgers. So there's two in there some more beef burgers so this is all the frozen stuff now let me show you everything else i got got this pizza it looks amazing i don't usually buy pizzas because they're not very good but this looked really good and i like the fact there was sourdough so i shall let you know what that was like some butter then some different types of ham i've got here honey roasted chorizo slices and italian inspired ham some cheese sliced mozzarella sticks some lean beef for casserole two things of honey yogurt chicken thighs i'm gonna show you in a minute what i'm gonna do with those lasagna cheese and onion slices just warm these in the cooker barbecue pulled pork and barbecue ribs some wild rocket brussels sprouts pork pies some mushrooms and then over here i have some of these caramel wafer bars i bought these are the two first things i've bought um, Oscar is about a month and a half away from starting his food, believe it or not. So I just saw these and they have very long expiry dates. Look, November next year. And I just thought, oh, I'll start buying a couple at a time. No, I intend to make some of it at home, but it's always nice to have these as well. Some Rocky Road bites almond thins these some of this stuff was on offer i'm going to tell you so this was on offer i think because it's part of their like um, christmas range i think so i can't remember how much it was i just thought that sounded really good like almond thins with white chocolate base and then paul loves these and i used to buy them all the time for him but i haven't in forever and again, they were on offer because they're part of their uh, Christmas range. Got two of these stock pots. These were on offer as well. Um, I never do this, but creamy tomato and baking and bacon pasta bake just to have handy. Not food, but I saw this intensive hand preserver. Um, I thought this might be nice some salt tuna and then i bought this barbecue chicken bag and seasoning for those you know just put everything in there chuck it in the oven job done some granola kitchen foil tomato puree rapeseed oil i love using that and some pink lady apples and then over here, I got some brioche bagels. I've never seen that before. They're not really bagels. They're just bread with a hole in it. But, you know, you, can, you can't call that bagels. But anyway, some naan breads to have in the cupboard. And some of this loaf. If you guys have not tried their 
they call it village bakery range they have all different types these are delicious um two things i actually thought i got three actually did i get three no maybe not then two things of wipes some bin liners got some multi-surface wipes one thing of hands wash some bugles and over there a big thing of nappies forgotten to show you one of the bags so i got some flowers as well i love it that they're really affordable some pitted olives some sunflower spray there's the other packet of wipes some parsnips what these called nectarines and lemons all of that just because i ran out of nappies but well, i didn't run out i had like four or five but it wasn't gonna last me very long was it now stay tuned next is coming up that's our microwave our soup is ready <laughs> um a little bit of our christmas we had a good time though the sleep thief wow he was in full force this uh, christmas season he did not care whether or not we wanted to open presents he just cared about himself and if you don't know who i'm talking about I'm talking about oscar he has ruled this household with the not letting us sleep very much but at least we were able to tag each other out so we could have naps but overall we were very happy to be together to be healthy so yeah let me show you <laughs> this footage and i'll see you guys in the new year take care you guys happy new year bye got to say for yourself what are you saying hey <laughs> are you chatting <laughs> is that so you're you're one of the legends they talk of the great alexander baby what's going on you are clever guy, right? but at the same time it's not like me i can say i am the strongest man in the world who says so? Hey! <laughs> Christmas day and we have the meat in the slow cooker it's a, in a broth of like onions red wine carrots I'll link the recipe below so that's cooking I prepped the veg yesterday I'm gonna cook the potatoes in here this is for the Yorkshire puddings I'm gonna cook the spr sprouts there and then in the fridge mini trifles that we're gonna have today there's the rest of the trifle there for tomorrow i have stuffing with sausage meat and vegetarian well without the sausage meat basically and i've got the batter for the yorkshire puddings um, that's that oh here i've got the prawns which have defrosted they're going to go in the oven 